now i will discuss the implementation of multiplexer using the model sim so i have to click on the jump start next we have to click on the create a project the project name will be multiplexer and here we will implement 4 to 1 so multiplexer 4 underscore 1 I will click on OK then I will create a new file I will give the same name multiplexer underscore sorry 4 underscore 1 and I will very log and I will click on OK I will close it next I will have to write the program I am writing the program in the same way and uh, here all the input and output are the declared and, and the expression is declared or expression is expressed like this way and uh, there will be a semicolon now this is the program now I will have to save it so I am making it safe now I am changing the layout from maximize to no design now I will have to compile it so I will click on compile and compile selected now you can see that compiler multiplexer 4 to 1 was successful now I will click on update next I will have to click on simulate then start simulation then under work library you can find that multiplexer 4 to 1 then you can click on ok now it is being optimized now you will have to click on the simulation and when you will have to click on the solution take the first row and do them all items are region now you can see that there are a b c d x y and d out you can check it from the program what is a b c d and x y and uh, this was the program a b c d were the input x y or the control line selection line you can take it x y as the selection line and a b c d was the input and the d out is the output now from the simulation from the waveform we will have to put the value here we can put the value of force using 1 next we can put the value of b equal to 1 next you can put the value of c equal to 1 so i am making all the input 1 now I am making the value of t equal to 0 so I am giving it 0 now I am giving the selection line value x equal to 1 and y equal to 1 now I will run it and when you run it you can see that the d out value is zero why because the value of d equal to zero and the selection line value is one one and one one when the value of selection is one one this input will be the d out output now if the value of i am changing the value of y to zero then when it is one zero then the value of c will be the output so I am changing the value of y to 0 so the value of y becomes 0 now when you, you can add it that you can see that the value of d out equal to 1 and we will have to zoom in to get the difference you can see the waveform here now this is the way how multiplexer is being implemented